I have to say, over the course of construction out here, there's certain places that I've found particularly warm and cozy. For instance, this little studio space, it's a tiny area, only about 14 by 12 square feet, but I can't wait to build some fires in there in the winter, and I know that it's a favorite place for Lucky and Angel. You know, having a small intimate space that's all your own is very important. Sherry Shin has come up with a fundraiser that focuses on this idea of miniature houses for children. We're looking at uh, Cozyville, actually. This is Kids Cozy Cottages, our fifth annual event, and our first year to have it at the Little Rock Zoo. And so it, we're delighted that we're having it outside this year, and we've opened it to so many more children this way. Arkansas Respiratory Health uh, has several programs to, uh, to fight lung disease. Each of these houses will be auctioned off to individual donors and we will deliver them and place them in uh, the backyards of some lucky child. <laughs> well, first and foremost, it has to be safe for children. We, we require that. All of the, the architects, the builders, the uh, interior designers and the landscape designers donate their time and their materials to us at no charge. The roofers, the framers, the flooring people, everyone involved donates their time. This is such a kid-friendly project and it's always so much fun for us to do this. And we love to take the, take the child to their fantasy, whether it's Hansel and Gretel's gingerbread house down at the very end. It, every child under five loved that house. They thought it was just perfect for them. And the next one is the Little Red Schoolhouse. You'll see right beside it. It's a little smaller and it's just beautifully decorated inside just with all the primary colors and it's perfect. The next one is the Ozark Log Cabin and it's just, it, it's fantastic inside. Then we have what we call the Diva House and it's definitely for a little girl. And then after that, we have the members only lodge and it's, it was the children's favorite this year. And then the last one we have is, is uh, called Frogwarts and it's a Harry Potter style. Uh, each child has their own little make-believe world and, and it's so much fun to see those little eyes light up when they walk into those little houses and just see how, how special they are. <laughs>